All right, yo, what's up everybody? I wanted to make a vlog today because I haven't made one in a minute. I've actually just been busy doing stuff for a new client that we got, me, JD, and Lonnie. You've seen it in the other vlogs, hopefully, but I've been basically spending all my time making videos for him and posting on their social media. That's kind of been taken away from my time vlogging. We did go boating two days ago, and I'm, I'm pretty disappointed with myself because I started to vlog the day and then I just stopped because I was drinking and I just didn't have my priorities set. I wanted to have fun and, and not worry about it rather than getting out my phone and vlogging and, and making a cool little video for you guys. I apologize about that. That is not gonna happen again because my priority is going to be making videos and uh, doing the socials for EMJ and making vlogs for you guys because that's what I like to do. So that's what I'm gonna do. But I wanted to make this video today to show you guys how I go about making a video, what mostly like the tools that I use, what do I record with, how do I edit, and uh, what other cool little gadgets I have to, to help me out. That being said, I record off my iPhone. I have an I, iPhone 13 Pro and I just set it up when I can or I'll hold it up like this. Or if you guys saw one of my other videos, uh, I have a gimbal from DJI. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda hate it. It never does what I want it to do. But uh, sometimes when I am taking slow-mo videos or just need a steady shot, it will work very well for that. So if I'm just trying to record myself like this, I don't have it in follow mode right now, but if I wanted to move around the room, I could have it just track me and follow me. You see it when I'm like throwing the football around, it'll, it'll track me wherever I'm going. That is another cool feature of the DJI. That's $160. I got it right from their website and it came in two days. The iPhone 13 Pro, I don't know, it was a, it was a little over $1,000 but it's it's the phone I use every day anyway. The reason I don't have a dedicated video camera is because the iPhone takes such good videos and pictures. You really don't need anything else. If I wanted to improve my audio, I could put an external mic on there and have a little lapel mic and I'll, I'll probably get one soon. But like for me, I just think this does the job. Uh, if you guys don't think the video quality is good, let me know and uh, maybe I'll invest in, in something better, but I think the iPhone does does a good job. We got the iPhone 13 Pro. We have the DJI gimbal. Now, this is a big investment that I just got and that is the iPad. Hold on, let me, let me clear these uh, messages here. That is the iPad Air. This is the iPad Air 5. It's the newest one. Let me take it out of the case here iPad Air 5, you can get it engraved for free. The engraving that I put on mine, just a really great quote that I love. The quote is, he who says he can and he who says he can't are both usually right. Basically, if you say you can do it, you can do it. If you say you can't do it, you're gonna believe that and you're not gonna do it. And that can go for anything, whatever it is. iPad Air, and the reason I got this is because since I'm taking all the videos on my personal phone, the storage fills up so quickly. There's only 128 gigs on my phone and on the iPad I got is 256. But what I can do, rather than having to take an SD card out, pop it into my laptop, transfer all the footage, and then go from there, which takes so long to do, hours and hours of my day, I'll just airdrop anything that I record off my phone. I'll airdrop it right to my iPad, I have it, delete it from my phone, and then I can actually just start editing on the iPad. What I use to edit, for the most part, is just CapCut. So I'll open up CapCut, start a new video, I'll select from my images, whatever, go into it. This is this is just one of the videos I did for, for the tin shop, but I can go in, do all my edits, export it right there, straight to YouTube. It makes everything super easy, super portable. This thing is so light, it's like a maybe a pound, if that. And uh, I also got a keyboard with it. I got it off Amazon. I did get the Magic Keyboard from Apple. It sucks. I don't recommend it. You can only open it a little bit and then tilt the screen back and that's it. Don't recommend that. What I recommend is getting something off of uh, Amazon, like this guy right here. It's a hard case. You can open it like a laptop, right? And I'll just work like that. It actually lights up. So you can see the keys, which is really cool. You can spin it all the way around 
set it down like that. Maybe you want to watch a movie or something. So you can just set it. And, and this is the, obviously the iPad screen. So you just watch something like that. You can close it, make it go flat. Now you're just holding your iPad, doing whatever. And then just a bunch of stuff. Lay it flat, do all sorts of angles, flat like that. But yeah, I think I think this is really cool. This one is called Type, T-Y-P-E, Type Case. It was like 69 bucks on Amazon, something like that. And uh, if you see, I also got the Apple Pencil. This makes it super easy to edit, um, find details as well. Check this out. You can engrave the pencil for free too. So of course I did. And what better saying should I put on my pencil than, ah, come on, focus. Hopefully you guys can see that right here. It says stay blessed with a little heart. That's cool. This is actually, this pen reminds me to like keep vlogging. Cause I'll be like, oh my God, I haven't vlogged in a while. And then I'll, I'll, I'll go back to it. Thank this pen when I put out vlogs. Something else super cool about uh, about the iPad. Hold on. Something else super cool about the iPad that I love. You guys know I have a camera, right? So I'm going around, take my pictures. What I can do on the iPad, rather than having to get a laptop out and set that up and convert all my images over, check this out. Camera, I gotta get something. This is an SD card to USB or USB-C, which is for the iPad. So what I can do, check this out, so cool, right? Boom, take a picture, awesome. Pop out the little card on the camera. Got my SD card, throw it into the side of this thing. Here, we don't need USB, so let's, ah! Plug that, All right? So we have our little USB, pop it in the iPad. Now, rather than having to pull up images on this little screen right here, I'll just log into the iPad. This thing is so cool. Go to my files, go to my USB. Wait for it. Look at this. This is, this is all the images I have on my camera right now. I'm gonna pull one up of a, my friend's dog. Super cute. Let's turn the brightness up a little bit too. Now, look at that. You can look at your images super quick. Look at that dog, dude. This is my friend Aaron and Kelsey's dog. His name's Pennywise. Super cute. Little mini... Uh, hopefully I don't mess this up. Mini Australian Shepherd bossy type dog mix. Anyway, look at that. Now you can just scroll through all your photos. Look at look at Lonnie. Dude, I should be, or I am basically his personal photographer. He should be paying me money for all these shots I'm getting of him. Anyway, super cool. This thing I think is like 15 bucks on Amazon. It's called B-Kill. B-Kill? Where you at? Where you at? There you go. I don't know, go check that out. And then uh, SD cards, obviously, the camera was like 450. I got a really good deal on that camera, but that's really all I use. Between the phone and the iPad, that's how I'm making videos. When I do stuff for EMJ, what I'll do is take the gimbal, put my phone on it, just record them doing their, their tint stuff. And then again, I'll send all my, my videos over to my iPad and then I'll just brainstorm and I'll come up with ideas of what do I want to do with this shot? What do I want to do with that one? I can make a funny reel or I can make like a cool, like them getting the bubbles out slow-mo type thing. And, uh, and then I try to get 20 pieces of content made so I can have them ready throughout the week. That's how I've been using my equipment. I still have here. I don't know if I can boom, boom. I still have a MacBook here, but uh, I don't really use it. All I use it for is if I'm doing anything with After Effects, which is like the animating software, because I can't do that on the iPad. And then I still have another computer here, which is what I used to edit videos on, because it was actually faster than the MacBook. I really don't use that much either, so I'm gonna, I'll find something else to do with it, but uh, it is a, a still powerful computer. But for those of you who are still watching, and uh, if you're not already subscribed, please hit subscribe. It helps me out. Leave a like, leave a comment, whatever you got to do to help me out. But I have been slacking on videos. I'm trying to get back on it. It's just like with the tin shop, I want to make sure we're providing value to him before I, I worry about myself. And uh, like I said, I, I started drinking the other day on the boat, which would have been awesome videos. And um, instead I, I just let it go because I was too worried about having fun rather than 
going out and, and recording content for you guys. I apologize about that. There will be other boat days, I promise. Kayla's actually at her parents' pool right now. I might go over there, we'll see. But uh, a lot of, uh, a lot going on constantly. Just gotta worry about vlogging, gotta worry about the tin shop, gotta worry about my day job, gotta worry about family and friends and life. And it just gets crazy. I was actually mowing my yard right before this. I have a really big yard, so I need a riding mower. I think I ran into a rock or a tree stump or something bent the the housing what it was it called it's not called case but it's basically the deck i think it's called the deck i bent the deck which is the basically the housing around the, the actual blades in a riding mower i bent the deck and then all of a sudden i'm just looking down and there's smoke everywhere and i'm like oh my god i'm gonna set this lawnmower on fire and my lawn basically the blades because it got bent in the blades just started it was metal on metal screeching burning madness i spent two hours trying to bend the metal back and i couldn't my yard is barely mowed right now and i just too tired to figure that out right now so if any of you know any tricks or tips i was banging it with a hammer but if any of you know like tips or tricks dad help me out to unbend a metal frame like that it's a thin piece of metal but it, it's still tough to bend out and uh, I, I was taking a blowtorch and I was like, trying to heat the metal. I'm thinking I'm smart. I'm like, oh yeah, it's gonna loosen it, bend it. Didn't work. I tried throwing it in reverse <laughs> and hitting it, hitting the rock from the back to just bend it back. Couldn't get the right angles. That's what I've been trying. Anyway, I'm too, I'm too tired and dehydrated to figure it out. I'm gonna end it here. Guys, thank you for tuning in. If you're still here, thank you for watching. I do appreciate it. I like to get to know my viewers more because like Kelsey said she was viewing my video and I'll throw in a clip right now. This is uh, one of my subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Fans. She's gonna be a subscriber by the end of the day for sure. Like, I already am a subscriber. No, you're not. Are you on YouTube? This video on oh, Let's go! You can't stop laughing. She said she was a subscriber and I didn't even know. But like, I think it's really cool. I've had several people come up to me like, I'm subscribed and I'm like, what? I didn't know you were subscribed. And it just makes me super happy. It makes me want to put out more videos. Positive feedback or negative feedback, whatever. I, I love to hear it. And it just makes me know there is somebody on the other side of this camera watching. I love you guys. I'm so proud of you, whatever you're doing, whatever you're going through. As I'm filming this right now, it's actually 4th of July. Happy 4th of July. Hope you're out uh, enjoying fireworks, doing something cool. And uh, as always, Stay blessed. Stay blessed, guys.